How many times have you been back to Italy since? I know you was there in 2000. I've been uh, to Italy I've been, uh, four times. First time I went in the 50, early 50s on holiday to Sorrento. And I, on holiday there I left my wife uh, there on, on the coast. And you? Uh, at and there and at Sorrento and I caught early morning train at five o'clock to get to Rome and then to Cassino, another train to Cassino and I went there on my own. I was determined to take the same path as I did in 44. I started there at the barracks. First I had to get there, I got to the station and I knew the distance about four kilometers to to this to the barracks where I wanted to start my climb. Yeah. So I got in a taxi to told the driver uh, bar uh, to go to the barracks, right? And uh, And we're traveling, and halfway to the barracks, he turned around and says, Are you, are you a soldier? I, I say, I'm not a soldier. I was a, a textile worker then. I'm not a soldier, I say. So why, why are you going to the barracks then? I say, I want to climb to, to the Monte Cassino. I say that's, he says, that's the wrong way. I'll, because there was no road from the barrack, you had to climb, yeah. walk, right? I, I, I say, I'll take you up the road. You can, I say, I don't want to, to, to be taking the taxi, I want to walk. He says, like talking to a, 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 a non harmless non-harmful, as a harmless madman. Well, you, I can take you to the top. If you want to walk, you can walk down. <laughs> I say, no, let's go to the barracks. And we go to the barracks. I got off and took the same path as I did, exactly the same way I went as I went in 44, quite enjoyed every minute. And on purpose, I, I had a rucksack and I, I, I had a quite a heavy load on purpose. I wanted to go through the same experience, the same feeling as I in 44. God. And then that, th then you said you've been another three times? Pardon? You've been three more times? And, so, and I climbed to the top, of course. Yeah. And when, when did you go? You've been again since? And then, uh, then in places where I, I said I didn't shed a drop of blood, blood during the battle, but I went there in in fifty six. I had to get through the place. Got overgrown with bushes, and there was there was a bare ground. Then in forty four, by the time I went next time, it was overgrown with um shrubs, spiky shrubs, and I, all my arms and I was wearing short on my legs were bleeding and arms I was bleeding so I want to go to the abbey but I couldn't like that so I knock on the door and ask for water and I, this were my only wounds as you can you call it. it the first time I lost my blood it was then 12 years after the battle <laughs> yeah. I had to knock on the door and ask the lady for, for some gave me a big... And that was in 56? Container.